Hey guys, uh, iPhone support fast here. Uh, today we're going to be looking at how to get Google Voice on your iPhone or iPod Touch. Um, what Google Voice is, it's, it's a service where you can go on and uh, select your own number. On it. You can manage your uh, number online and send it to basically any device you want. Um, and so we're going to find out today how to get it on your iPhone or iPod Touch which is a really nice app uh, that's not available in the App Store yet. Uh, so, the first thing you're going to want to make sure you do is make sure that your iPhone or iPod Touch is jailbroken, uh, which you can find on my website, uh, which is the first link, um, or on one of my YouTube videos. So, once your iPhone or iPod Touch is jailbroken, um, you're going to open up the Sedia app, which is right here. Um, and then you can choose, uh, usually developer is the one I choose. Now at the bottom you should see uh, sections, changes, manage, on uh, search. What we're going to do is uh, click on search. You do want to make sure that you're connected to the internet in order to do this. Um, so and then it has to load the data and things like that. But once it's done, uh, just at the bottom click on search. Uh, and you should be able to search for different applications through uh, Cydia. Um and then you can update. Um, if it needs updates, usually do upgrade um, complete. Um, so you get everything. But for right now, we're not going to do anything. So at the top, you just type in G is in golf and V is in Victor. And you should see um, a couple options. But the one that we're going to want today is called GV Mobile. So you click on GV Mobile. And it should bring up a window like this. Um, and then at the top right you should see something that says install so we're going to click install and once we do that this is going to come up saying that it's 379 kilobytes um, and we can either cancel that or we can confirm it but we're going to want to confirm it because that's what we're going to want to download so at the bottom it will give you a status bar it will do uh, something like this and then just click return to Cydia now we're done so if you click the home screen as you can see we now have Google Voice Mobile on our iPod Touch and this will also work for the iPhone but it works better for the iPhone because on the iPod Touch you can't actually fully use the phone because your iPod Touch doesn't have a number to it so what we're going to do is we're going to open up Google Voice Mobile and it's going to tell us we want to sign in so you just put your username here put in your password here um, turn on auto refresh and then uh, to make voice calls you just click here uh, on the keypad that's going to allow you to make calls uh, text messages on your Google Voice are on the SMS your history is here and your voicemail is down here um, in order to make calls you do need to be connected to the internet uh, because if you're not uh, I won't allow you to do it and like I said um, you can't use uh, the calling feature on the iPod touch because it doesn't have a number to sign to it. So when you're on your iPhone and you use this app, all you're going to do is you're going to dial out and press call. What it's going to do then is it's going to send it over the server um, and then your phone's going to ring. Once you answer your phone, uh, your call's in progress. So that's how you uh, use this app and that's how you get Google Voice Mobile on your iPhone or iPod Touch. Uh, if you guys have any questions, feel free to email me. I'll put my email address on the side. Uh, check out our website, uh, iPhone uh, Support Now is a great site. So how you get to that is uh, web.me.com backslash iPhone Support Fast. Uh, you can also find that in the tab on the right of your screen. Um, your donations are greatly accepted um, from iPhone Support Fast. Thanks.